Like dead at you? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was pretty close. <laughs> oh, oh shit! Oh my god! Oh ah! my god! Ah! 911! Ah! Ah! Oh fuck! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, that was not a good idea! Come on, come on, come on. Dude, are you on? Come right? on, here. Let's go. Put pressure on, on it. Wrap the napkin. Oh. Shit. Oh. Lance, come on, come on, let's go. Let's go. Come on, dude. Oh. Come on. We gotta get you stitched up, dude. He cut his hand with um a, a like, I don't know how to explain it. I'm like. Dude, are you all right? Lance. Lance. Lance, come on, get off. I think he off. just passed out. We're, come on, wake up. Oh my God. Lance. <laughs> Nate, get in the house. Breathe. Just calm Jesus down. Jesus Christ, get your mother. Lance, wake up. Yo, grab the napkins and put pressure on that. Where's the cut at? Where? On his finger. This one. The two fingers right there. Where's W Nina, come here. Calm down. You're calm. You're all right. You're all right. Come on. I'm calling on my Control the bleeding. Control the bleeding. Put the camera down. <laughs> he wanted me to keep recording. Yo, everyone's going to think I'm an asshole for recording this. Dude, honestly, I was numb at first. I didn't even feel it. Who witnessed it? We have it recorded. You want to say it? They recorded it. Yeah. I'm actually still trying to say it. Nice, man. You'll see us some more. Really, Lance? I can't. Somebody got me. Ready? Sorry about that, bud. One, two. I can tell you where we're going. Or actually, I'll call you when we're done. How about that? We'll let them know. All right, guys, going in. You're gonna, I can't. They're gonna have to date me, okay? Well, guys, this sucks. Two, though. <laughs> I'll trade you. Two's good. I'll tell you what, Nathan. The marijuana makes you just want to be full. How are you feeling about this, Ma? Not good. This yeah. Not fucking good. I know. I got blood all over my shirt, blood all over my hands, both hands, actually. The cut is so deep on my other hand, guys. This is bad. Uh, if anybody's eating right now, I'm sorry. We're going back there now. I guess I'm just gonna wait and see what happens. I'm probably gonna have to end up getting stitches. I don't wanna look at it. My mom doesn't wanna look at it. Yeah, I cut a pretty hefty hole in my hand. And it's in my palm as well. It's on both fingers. Can you stop talking? My mom wants me to stop talking. Oh, I can't. My mom's about to pass out right now. I just went over there and tried cleaning this hand off. There's nothing wrong with this hand, thank God. But this hand is fucked. So, we're gonna sit in the hospital, dab a little bit, and uh, let's see what happens. That does not look pretty. That's a huge gash. All right, so everybody came through. We're just waiting right now. I think I have to get stitches, which sucks, but what am I gonna do, you know? No more uh, Fruit Ninja in real life. No more knives Guys, you. nobody do that. Yeah, I can't Nobody play. send my kid more knives. <laughs> <laughs> Considering I got like 20 today. Give me a pair of sneakers, by the way. Dude, there's blood all over mine, too. Look. Guys, do me a huge favor and learn from me and don't do anything stupid like this because I just fucked myself. I have no feeling in my pinky. I can't even bend it. I think it's broken or... I have nerve damage, I think. My mom thinks I have nerve damage. I don't even know. Uh, it's gonna be a long night though. Do not play with knives ever. Mm -hmm. So I just went into the back and got x-rays for my hand. Right, right now we're just waiting for it to get stitched up and we should be on our way. I still have no feeling whatsoever in my pinky. Hey guys, I drew a smiley face with my blood. <laughs> I understand how you're so calm. How am I, I calm? That's how he handles things because he doesn't know how to handle anything. I don't know how to react. Like, I laugh when I get in pain sometimes. Oh, I know. I know. Yeah. But anyway, it's a smiley face for you guys. So I just got numbed. Um, and apparently it wasn't enough, so I need to get some more. 
and it hurt like a bitch. It hurt so bad. Uh, it's but not the, like a normal needle, like that shit kills. But this time they have to numb in the wound. Yeah. Oh, are they gonna go in there? Yes. Fucking man. I'm all numbed up now, now I'm gonna get my hand cleaned off and we're gonna prepare the stitching. Alright guys, so I just got my stitches. I have to get, I think, one or two here, three up here, and I don't even know how many there. <laughs> there's about nine in that one. Yeah, there's a lot of stitches, guys. This was a stupid idea, that is for sure. Now he just wants food. <laughs> yeah, I'm starving. <laughs> I got him a donut oh, thank and you. fruit salad. <laughs> <laughs> when Lizzie called the police, what did you say? She said, we were playing real life Fruit Ninja. <laughs> and the lady was like, no, the what? Man, the man was like, he was like, Fruit Ninja? <laughs> <laughs> And then my mom also called, so there was like 12 cops at my house, I'm not even exaggerating. There was so many cop cars when we went out there, and my mom said I chopped my hand off. I didn't know because I couldn't see you because your sister was having a panic attack. There was just blood everywhere. And I, I couldn't look, and all I saw was you go down, that's when I got the phone, and I didn't know Lizzie was I felt go. super dizzy and nauseous, and I just like... I did too. And they're like, alright, somebody's talk. already on the phone with us. I'm like, okay. Uh, I want to say yeah, uh, but I'll double check on that. Okay. We'll grab one from you. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm all wrapped up now. We're actually going to get a metal splint for the pinky to make sure I don't move that and bend it and irritate it. <sighs> I don't even know how I'm going to edit now. That's what I said. You want me to help? <laughs> oh, and i got to get a technus shot too. I can't even say it correctly. How's tetanus. Tetanus, tetanus or technus? Tetanus. 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 Okay, tetanus shot guys. I want to show you that. how to wear Just got my technus shot. <laughs> tetanus. <laughs> tetanus. Tetanus. <laughs> Just got, I know, tetanus shot. I don't know, it wasn't too bad. That was like... <laughs> when she was putting it in, I was I was confused because I like, get hurt, but I was like, I don't know. <laughs> this is how it's signed. Hey, it worked. All right. All right. <laughs> Good. What's up, guys? How you guys doing today? So if you guys remember yesterday when we tried that ice cream maker and we didn't freeze the bowl long enough, so it actually didn't end up working correctly. I'm gonna try and make it the correct way today. I had the bowl in the freezer for the past 24 hours. It should be more than frozen enough to actually do this now. So let's try it out. So this packet of ice cream makes up the two quarts. Unfortunately, I don't think that freezer bowl is big enough to use all of this ice cream mix so I'm just gonna cut it in half like I did yesterday getting all the ingredients stirred up right now now it's gonna take out the freezer bowl which is in here behind the pizza oh yeah this thing is frozen oh my god it's so cold all right it's all stirred now let's try and pour it into here see the problem we had yesterday is when we took the top off it actually all seeps through so you gotta leave this on I can't take it off All right, we were actually able to use all of it. All right, so now it's stirring up, and in about 20 minutes, it should be good. Hey, Grandma, hit it. Hey, 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 Grandma dabbing on these hoes. Pizza, and then you can watch it while I go get a shower. Yeah. Get dressed. Decided to eat some pizza, and then by the time I, my pizza's actually done, this should be done as well. There's only two minutes left of the 20-minute timer that we set, and it's starting to look pretty good. I think... I think we might have to leave it in there for like another five or ten minutes though, just so it's not too watery. I remember back in the day, me and Grandma used to make our own ice cream all the time. Yes, we did. Back in my day. Back in the day. <laughs> <laughs> but what we would do is we would get two plastic bags, and in one of the plastic bags, we would put salt and ice. And then in the other plastic bag, which was a smaller one, we would put all the Indeed. all the ingredients in for the ice cream. And then we would put the one bag in the other bag and then shake it up for like 15, 20 minutes. And we had good ice cream. Yeah, and we made ice cream. It was pretty <laughs> good oh, yeah. we, we, we're gonna have to do that again sometime yes, that'd be fun. I used to do it a lot it was really fun yeah, don't take all this time either <laughs> <laughs> oh shit grandma damn yes. <laughs> so I just took a scoop of the ice cream with a spoon and it's actually turning out pretty good it tastes amazing too but the only thing is that it's still a little bit watery so we got to leave it in there for like another 10 minutes at least pizza just got done looking good ice cream's almost done it's starting to get super thick. You can see it's like looking like it's about to overflow pretty soon. So I just tried a little bit of it and it still seems to be a little bit watery. But we're going to try and pour it into a cone and see what happens. Alright, let's try it out. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> it's got to freeze longer. It's been 30 minutes though. Mmm, these sugar cones are bomb as fuck. What do you think? It's good, but it's just not frozen all the way yet. Yeah. What about you, Graham? You like it. It's not bad. I just hit my mom with the Nerf gun. She's trying to hit me now. You better be scared, Joel. Get him, Amy. Get him. 
I'll break your ice cream maker. <laughs> Lizzie's getting impatient, so she's gonna try it again. It's still too watery. Well, I'm not gonna wait. Did it get any better? Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> Getting your sprinkles? Yeah, but it's not coming. It's not coming? There you go. Okay. Those sugar cones are honestly oh, amazing. Like, I probably had like three of those things, right? How many did you have? This is your second? Stop making the shit. Third? Right Third. <laughs> Third? My mom's eating it too. She said stop making it because it's making her fat, she thinks. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> hey, whatever. I don't care. I'm getting fat too, so. You're not alone. You are not I'm alone, alone. trust me. <laughs> she somehow managed to get it all over herself. It dripped out the bottom of my phone. Okay guys, so today we're gonna be playing this game called Operation. If you guys have never played this game before, you basically have a board that we have right here, and there's all these pieces inside of each body part. You have these tweezers here, and you have to try and get the piece out of here without touching the sides, and if you touch the sides, it vibrates and you're out. So this is what we're gonna play right now. I haven't played this game in forever. I used to play this when I was a kid. And yeah. Then I played it with you guys. Yeah, this game got really updated since I played though. Hey. Keep going. Yeah, until you hit the side. Fuck. <laughs> what? <laughs> ha ha ha. Well, I still ha, took ha. it out. Lizzie's failed like every time Listen. so far. Listen. Ah! <laughs> I failed again. <laughs> Stop laughing at. Ah! <laughs> You suck like, at this game, Lizzie. No, I don't. <laughs> I just went after the hard one. Well, we played the game and I ended up winning. I had seven and would you have five? Yeah, and Lizzie didn't get any. <laughs> I got the bell. After yeah, the after like cheating pretty much. Okay guys, so dating back a few months ago, my mom's car has always had like these crazy problems. Like we would drive through water and every single time we do, she gets this weird noise in her car. Like I don't know if her transmission is fucked up. She always brings it back to the place and they say that there's nothing wrong with it. And she's honestly just annoyed of it. <laughs> so she's had this car for the past like how many years, mom? Like three years now? Yeah, my lease is up. Yeah, and her lease is up anyway. So I think we're gonna trade in that car and go get a different car today. We're just not sure what exactly she wants to get yet. She has a couple different choices in mind. I know what I want and I know what you want me to get. I'm getting what I want. Okay, she wants a Cadillac SUV. I want her to get the Cadillac CTSV, which is a sports car, and it's honestly fucking I sexy looking. I sports car. We have sports cars. I think she should get the sports car. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we're gonna go over to the Cadillac dealer right now. They were looking at Mercedes the other day, but my mom just didn't like the sports car type of feel. I think she was looking at an SLK, but it was a two-seater car, and I guess she just doesn't like that. I wanna try and test drive the CTSV though. I just wanna get a feel for it and see how it is. We just got over to the Cadillac dealership, and this is what my mom's looking at right now. You like this one? I do. So at this Caddy dealership, they actually don't have a CTSV. So unfortunately, I can't test drive it. I don't know, sit in the passenger seat. It's, uh, oh, it's pretty nice. Hit the fan button up. Oh. We're going to take this car for a little test drive right now. My mom wants to see how it rides. We just left Cadillac. We were going to head over to another dealer that's in Atlantic City. But we went to stop at BMW really quick just because we're over here anyway. This area is pretty much like an auto mall. There's a bunch of different dealerships over here. There you go, mom. Get an I-8. You don't want an I-8? <laughs> so just... let me just publicly blast Penske Automotive Auto Mall because I don't like them to begin with. But their customer service sucked because we walk in. I'm like, okay, where are your SUVs in the BMW store? They're like, oh, out to the left. We walk out. I think the salesperson's behind me. He just went back to his desk to do nothing. Yeah, it was Something terrible. Is so wrong with this generation. So we pretty and much said fuck it. Sucks, so I won't even look at a car here now. Yeah, so we said fuck it. It's not even worth it. Like, what? I've never I've seen never anything seen like that in my life. People who don't want to fucking sell a car, but it's all good. I actually just got a call from the UPS store, and they said that I'd mail there now. So we're gonna stop there on the way home. We're at the UPS store. Let's see what we got today. Got a pretty good amount today. Pretty good amount. So if you guys are going to Playlist this weekend, I'm gonna tell you guys my meetup group so you guys can come by. So my meetup is meetup group six, it's the pink stripe, and it's Saturday at 2.30 p.m. So make sure to come by, guys. How about you just told me to stop, and then you shoot me? All right, let's get started. Uh, I see a knife. Oh my God, another one? <laughs> <laughs> this is from Jack Dankawater. Ooh, that's kind of sick. Damn, that's neat. huge. That's wow. neat. Thank you. This is from Grace. Looks like we got a book in here. The Book of Totally Irresponsible Science. 
Featuring how to grow a Frankenstein head, how to turn milk into stone. Oh, oh so it's like a bunch of cool science experiments that we can do. That's awesome. Oh. Thank you. Maybe we can try some of these out. And she also sent over this target. Thank you. <gasps> oh my gosh. What? That's not a box of knives. It That's is. A knives. It's a box of like eight knives. Oh, can Grandma have one? <laughs> I never have one. <laughs> a gift from Lisa Block. Hi, I'm a big fan. Keep up the good work from Jake, aka Warrior. Holy crap, let's check out all these knives. Yeah, oh my gosh. Okay, three, six, nine. There's 12 knives in here. Oh my gosh. So yeah. Oh, I think we have one of these, but this is awesome. Thank you. Are these all the same exact knife? I don't know. I can just have We got two of these. Uh, we got another one. I think they're all the same knife. Another one, another one. Yeah, guys, they're all just the same exact knife. Look at that, guys. We got 12 of the same knives. Thank you. Here we got a Linsky sharpener. Oh, this is a blade sharpener for our knives. That is awesome. Frank was actually just talking about something like this the other day to me. This is from JT Wheelock. Thank you, man. You need that. Yeah, this will come in handy for sure. Oh, <laughs> we got some more knives. And then something else in here. So there's a knife in here for Sabrina and there's one for Grandma. So this knife is for my sister. Ooh. Cool. That's sweet looking. Yes, it is. She'll like that. <laughs> hey, hey. Look at that one, Grandma. Cool. Purple. Is that purple? It's all different colors. Wow, I love it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Zippo. Is this a lighter? Oh my gosh. Look at this lighter. This is for Grandma oh, too. Oh, thank you. I haven't seen one. Don't scratch it. I haven't seen one of them in years. That's cool. I got my uh, lighter fluid for it. Cool. Thank you so very much. That's awesome. Thank you. I think I see funnel cake. I don't know. <laughs> then we also got some dog bones in here. Aww. This is from Curtis Pearson. Thank you, Curtis. Ah, another knife. <laughs> oh, it's like the other one that we got the other day. It's nice. That's awesome. That's Thank you. Really sharp. This is from Jordan. Thank you, Jordan. I think this is gel for your hair. Extreme sport. Level 10 hold. Thank you, maybe I can try this out in my hair. Hopefully it works pretty good. We got some more knives. Oh, wow. <laughs> I feel like every box today was like a knife of some sort. Just about. That's cool. Whoa. Look at that one. That's different. That's sick looking. Yes, it is. Thank you. This is kind of like a hunting knife. Ooh, ooh. Look at that one. It's even got a uh, piece of plastic on the tip. It's sharp. Yeah. And we also got a knife sharpener as well. Thank you. This is from Patrick Harnega. <laughs> we have more knives. Oh my goodness. It says to pick my favorite and then one is for Frank and one is for Lizzie. This is from Gary A. Thank you, Gary. Oh, this is kind of like the other one. Thank you. Holy crap. That's crazy looking. That's awesome. Sweet. Thank you. <laughs> Another knife. <laughs> this is from Nicholas Young. Let's see what kind of knife you sent over. Is that all you got today besides smoking? Yeah, it was all nice. Ooh. Ooh. I like that. That one's awesome. Wow, sharp. Holy crap. That is nice. That is so it sweet. Is. is that a beer bottle opener? I don't know. I, I don't know if it's big enough, actually. I forgot what it's for, but thank you. This is sick. This is from Victor and Melanie Marrero. And here it looks like we got some cracked screen prank, raspberry lemonade, rattlesnake joke, squirt toilet seat, some more raspberry lemonade, squirt lighter, window cling, sour gummy bears, raspberry lemonade, this little sign that they made, Lance 210, great pranks, there with an air horn, thank you. And they also made this shirt for us. Aww, that's Lance nice. 210 pranks, there with an air horn. Aww, that's that's awesome, thank you. We gave Gio the bone and this thing's too big for him. It's gonna take him a while, but he'll start munching on it. He's a little tired right now. You like it, boy? He just shook his head yes. Did you see that? So my dad just got home not too long ago. We're all gonna go out right now and grab some food for dinner. We're gonna be going to this place, Carabas, which I love their soup there. It's bomb. So I'm pretty hyped right now. All right, guys, I just wanted to tell you some exciting news really quick. I'm actually gonna be going to Puerto Rico, and I'll be there on September 17th for this event called Vlogging. I'll be doing a meet and greet there, and if you guys live in Puerto Rico, make sure to come out. I'll put the link down below in the top of my description. You guys can check out all the details there. I think it's gonna be super fun, and I can't wait to meet you all. I don't know why, guys, but it's only when I sit in the back of a car that I feel car sick. I always have to roll down the windows and I usually just sit here like this the entire time because I just feel super sick. I don't know what's wrong with me. I had those seat bands that somebody sent me. I, I gotta remember the next time I'm sitting in the back of a car to put those on and try it out. So the place that we wanted to go to isn't open yet and they don't open for like another 50 minutes. So I think we're just gonna end up going to another place. So since Applebee's was the closest place, we just decided to come here really quick. 
They're both sitting here jamming to the song that's playing right now. What even is this? <laughs> I don't even know. Back in the day. Somebody made this meme of grandma while she's holding the sniper at me and Frank was actually about to shoot me. So I was dodging him and they quoted ground saying that's it motherfucker, no more scaring me. We just wrapped up eating. I am so stuffed. I didn't even get to finish all of my food. I got my food put in a container to bring home. I guess I'll just eat the rest later when I'm hungry. My mom's letting me sit up front because I'm getting car sick, so thank you, Ma. Yeah, now I'll get car sick. Now you're gonna get car sick. <laughs> I'm sorry, right at the <laughs> What? No, I fucking throw you right out that door. <laughs> what is she doing? Hitting you with a water bottle? Gonna it. A water Don't throw it. You're always throwing Dang. shit. I'm telling you, I'll throw you out that fucking door. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> make him sleep in the shed. You're making my dad sleep in the shed tonight? Yep. Yeah. My mom said that she's kicking him out of the room for tonight. He's going to sleep on the floor and the couch. <laughs> you can pick one. <laughs> my mom's gonna prank my dad with this water bottle. I just turned Whoa. on the sprinkler. Look, we're all getting wet now. I told you. Are you gonna be ice? <laughs> 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 tried. You tried. Look, it's all over you. <laughs> I feel like they do this yeah, once a week. I just caught that. <laughs> oh, she's whacked. <laughs> oh, yo, you just moved the whole. Oh, my God. <laughs> Dude, mom, you pushed the whole thing off. Look, it's falling off. All right, guys, so to be honest, I haven't done crap within the past hour. We got home, and I just laid in my bed. I wasn't feeling that great because I was pretty much in, like, a food coma. You guys always hear me talking about this. Like, as soon as I eat too much food, I get to the point where I just feel like passing out. So I just laid down and went on my laptop and just watched videos the whole time. But me and Lizzie wanted to go outside really quick and go into the pool and jacuzzi, so that's what we're going to do right now. I do the same shit, like, every day, I feel like. I'm pretty sure that me and Frank aren't here in the gym today he said he wants to take a little break for today but i'm pretty sure what's going to end up happening is i'm going to be running tonight i'll do a little bit of cardio lizzie is going to come with me as well but i don't know if frank's going to come kick her in no i have my phone <laughs> all right so she just tried throwing me in the pool i got you i got you now i'm texting <laughs> <laughs> i got her in <laughs> so she got her revenge she threw her ice cold cup of water all over me. <laughs> so I just got out of the jacuzzi and got changed. Frank said that he should be here soon, but it's gonna start getting dark pretty soon as well. So instead of waiting on him to get here before we go over to the store and get some watermelon and melons and stuff like that, I figured me and Lizzie will just go right now. So by the time we get back, Frank should be here and we can start doing it. We're back at Walmart. I feel like I come to this store pretty much every single day. We're gonna go in there, grab some fruits, and it's already looking like the sun's starting to go down, which sucks. I hope we have enough lighting for this video. Mini personal watermelons. I guess we're gonna get some of these. All right, so we got all this stuff. Pineapples, bananas, watermelons. Now we just gotta check out, but it looks like every line is long as fuck. Damn. <laughs> we're gonna be in here for a while. All these people in this line, for some reason, like every lane is pretty much closed right now besides two over there. That had to be one of the most annoying things ever. To self-check out fruits that don't have barcodes on that you can just scan. So you have to like manually go and type in the code. Honestly, it was just a pain in the ass. It took like 10 minutes just to like type in one code. Because I guess there's something wrong with their systems right now in Walmart and everything's lagging. All the computers are lagging like crazy. Honestly, I was just trying to come in here and get out really quick, but it didn't look like that was going to happen. Having fun? I just called Frank and he said he's laying on my couch right now. So yeah, we're definitely running late. Okay, guys, so we have all this fruit right here. Frank is here as well. And we got our blades and we're ready to do this. Real life fruit ninja. Oh, yeah. It's going to be fun. Busted open. Ah! <laughs> What's that? You threw it at me. You threw it at me. Oh, that was terrible. Lay straight here. Let's try this other sword. Close. There it goes. <laughs> oh my God! I feel like the watermelon is gonna come and hit me. Yo, that mango is pretty decent size too. All right, Lizzie wants to try. 
Oh, it hit me. It hit you? <laughs> I'm good at this. Here. Give me a banana. <laughs> nice. Go. Nice. Hey. You got both of them? No. Yeah. No, no, use both. That's sick. <laughs> that is not working, Frank. You're not even using enough force to even cut it. <laughs> oh, that's all I got off it. Yeah, get another. Oh, that was a perfect cut. I just Whoa. got watermelon juice all over me. That is such a perfect cut. <laughs> this is fun. Isn't it? Ready? <laughs> what the fuck, Lizzie? What was that? Don't throw it like that. <laughs> oh my God. You're going to kill the man. Here, I'll throw it. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Dude, that's a perfect cut. Looks like I'm gonna be vlogging only on my left hand from now on until I get these stitches out Which is gonna be in like two weeks But usually what happens is I'll switch off from each hand because like one arm might get a little bit tired So I just switch to the next one, but I don't know if that's gonna be happening I just realized that you just got a tetanus shot in that arm. It's gonna be so sore your muscle Oh, yeah, shit. I think I'm just gonna have to record it for the yeah Liz weeks. is gonna be recording me It's gonna be like a literally a reality TV show where I just get followed by cameras <laughs> <laughs> It's all good though guys I will find a way to make it work because, I don't know, I love doing this shit. There was a McDonald's on the way home, so we just decided to get that for food. And Frank also got me a donut earlier at Wawa. So thank you, Frank. Okay, guys, so I think I'm just going to end my vlog here. I am getting super tired. I don't really know how long it's actually going to take me to edit because of this shit all in my hands. And I regret doing it, but I hope you guys can learn from this and know not to fuck with knives. If you guys could do me a huge favor and leave a like on this video, I would really appreciate it. Don't forget to turn on my post notifications so you never miss a new video. And I will see you guys next time. There you go. <laughs> Abuse! Abuse! You don't even know how to work it. You're an adult. How's it abuse? <laughs>